As a filmmaker, I want to elevate voices and highlight stories that might not otherwise have a platform. I chose to come here to Barnard because I wanted to study the world. I wanted to study political science. I wanted to take classes in history. I wanted to be in class with chemists and future historians and politicians and bankers. And this is really informed my storytelling. One of my favorite classes is Civil Rights and Civil Liberties with Professor Paula Franzesi. Professor Franzesi is a brilliant civil rights lawyer and a very inspiring mentor. And a class inspired me to think about things in a new light and topics and discussions that I've never had before. And has definitely influenced some future creative projects of mine. The most important story I ever told is about my grandpa, Carl Shapiro, who is a Holocaust survivor. He spent his childhood hidden underground, underneath a barn, with his parents and 14 other Jews. He was saved by Polish Christian family and farmers. In 2014, I brought him back to Poland to reunite with the woman who saved him, and this turned into a feature-length documentary called The Barn. I was on the production team, I was one of the producers, but I was also dealing with my grandfather and there were cameras pointed at us and I simultaneously felt responsible for him and also responsible for the film. And balancing those two roles and working with the team and learning to rely on my director and the crew was a really good learning experience. We went back to my grandfather's hometown and visited the place where his house once stood. We also traveled to Auschwitz to see the concentration camps where so many other Jews had perished. We found the woman, Paulina, who was a child when her family decided to risk their own lives to save my grandfather's. Seeing my grandfather and Paulina reunite was unbelievable. They just hugged and sat on the couch I just remember thinking, this woman is directly responsible for his being alive and for my being alive. When we found the hole in the ground that saved my grandfather's life, we were all overcome with emotion. And my grandfather actually asked to go in, which I was not expecting. Something that I took away from this journey was that I realized that my grandfather was doing it for me. I wasn't bringing him back to heal him. Some wounds cannot be healed and some experiences are too painful to forgive or overcome. And that he was really coming back for me and for the sake of the film and for the sake of history to remember what happened there. But that it wasn't, it wasn't some healing trip for him. Make closure with us and try to, and enjoy life that I didn't get a chance to do. As crazy as it sounds, the film and this journey are not just about the Holocaust. The barn is about intergenerational connectivity and about hope and about how we cultivate empathy between people who might not look like us or practice faith the same way. And ultimately, it's about how we face tragedy. Besides all the academics, being here at Barnard has given me the confidence to find my own voice and to use it, which is invaluable as a filmmaker and as a woman.